Guangxi has entered the rainy season in June. It has a humid climate. Rainwater has filled the seasonal karst rainforest with life and vitality. The Hainan blue flycatcher belts out its first song of the day. If you listen carefully, the call of the bird resembles a catchy ditty. Following the lead singer, the mild chorus of birds lingers across the woodland. This is breeding season for the long-tailed broadbill. They are busy building a nest for their arriving babies. The couple works in turns. After completion, they joyfully chirp to express delight. During the mating season, they always get much louder. The streak-breasted scimitar babbler measures about 19 centimeters in length. During procreation, they often hide in the foliage and make calls. The beats are highly regular, like a rhythmical whistling, simple, clear, and vibrant. The elegantly shaped babbler is very shy and timid. The slightest disturbance could drive it to hide deep in the woodland. The insect-eating gray-checked fulvetta can make high-pitched calls. It is a close relative to the street-breasted scimitar babbler. The noisy fulvetta species is gregarious. It usually measures 14 centimeters in length. Despite its small stature, it never shows the white feather to larger birds. The calls of the fulvetta and babbler are like a duet at a concert, echoing each other harmoniously. In the limestone land of southwestern Guangxi live over 400 kinds of birds, including over 200 resident bird species. Due to the equatorial monsoons, the region has a hot summer with copious rainfall. Under the shade of the shrubbery, there is the vegetation, which, like a regulator, helps reduce temperature fluctuations within the forest. The moist and refreshing place has attracted numerous resident birds. The rock pits with accumulated rainwater serve as their best summer retreats. The rare Indo-Chinese green magpie measures about 32 centimeters in length and sports a blue-green plumage. It is hard to spot one clearly. This bird is bathing its feathers while remaining alert about its surroundings. Many migratory birds have yet to return, and the woodland chorus is missing some parts. The birds sing wholeheartedly on stage for the beauty of their home.